Meet Jenny, or at least Jenny's mouth. If you have teeth and you care about them, I guarantee what's going on in Jenny's mouth matters to you. Here's why. Jenny called me a while back and had a significant dental problem that her dentist had documented over about six years. He had hard photographic evidence that she was losing her teeth in those few short years at a rate that was more like what would normally happen over 40 to 50 years. Yikes! She had no pain, no sensitivity to cold, no difficulty chewing, no popping or clicking in her joints, no significant gum disease, and a few small incidental cavities. But given a few more years, she would wipe out her teeth in a way few people think of. Jenny takes pretty good care of her teeth, and I'm sure you do too, but she's not perfect. She does the usual brushing and flossing to take care of her mouth, and she visits her dentist and hygienist. But she also uses a secret weapon for a healthier smile. What is that weapon and why is it secret, I hear you ask? Nobody's been trying to keep it secret. It's just that good news sometimes travels slowly when there's not a major marketing push to inform the world. So we're going to do something about that because this weapon is something that you and everyone you care about should have in your arsenal for a healthier mouth. It's that powerful. The weapon is called electrolyzed oxidizing water or EO water for short. Electrolyzed means the water molecule is actually lysed or broken apart using electro forces or electricity. Oxidizing means the water takes electrons from the things that it touches and usually causes death. Why would I be suggesting you put something in your mouth that causes death? Because it causes death to microorganisms, bugs like bacteria and viruses and such. Which bacteria and viruses does it kill? every single one on which it's ever been tested and that includes HIV, MRSA, Salmonella, E. coli, along with your basic strep and staph bacteria that make up your dental plaque and it doesn't cause harm to us big folks who are larger than one cell. Here's a little secret, you've got several trillion cells so you're safe. So what's the problem? Why was Jenny's dentist so concerned? Because he thought her huge problem was a side effect of using EO water as a death to the bugs mouth rinse. What? Was this phenomenal secret weapon for a healthier mouth causing harm? If that was true, then that would really stink. So she called me to see what I thought. I'm a dental surgeon with years of experience with EO water and restoring mouths that become severely damaged for whatever reason. She wanted to stop this problem before it went any further. In our discussions, I found that there were some great lessons that you should know about that could be taught by looking at Jenny's situation. I decided to write a five-part series on our blog over at NoBSWater.com, and you can go check it out at any time. When we examined Jenny's mouth, we had to discuss in great detail the everyday risks of owning a mouth. Things like plaque and things it may cause, such as getting a small cavity or gum disease. We even got to the somewhat personal things that matter a lot, such as stinky breath that makes a person less kissable, and nobody wants that. However, not everyone wants to search through our blog for the five different parts of the series, so we at No BS Water decided to turn it into an ebook where the whole adventure can be had in one place. We also decided to make it free and encourage you to spread it around. The lessons you'll learn may save you years of heartache and thousands upon thousands of dollars in dental problems. It's especially important that mothers, fathers, grandparents, and teachers know this information so they can teach it to the next generation. With the secret weapon for a healthier mouth, EO water, we have a chance to leave a healthy mouth legacy to our children and grandchildren. But EO water does have side effects and risks just like your toothbrush, toothpaste, and floss. What? You can damage yourself with a toothbrush, toothpaste, and floss? Of course you can if you use them in a damaging way. So we've made sure to give advice that will save a lot of damage and heartache there too. When it comes to plaque removal, the rules of a healthier mouth state that you should get the gunk off and not do yourself any harm in the process. We'll show you exactly what that means. Protect your family. Get your ebook now at healthiermouthbook.com. You'll be glad you did, and I guarantee you there will be something valuable in there that you didn't know before. Even if you're one of the more than 90% of practicing dentists for which this material is brand new. Go ahead and get your ebook now.